In this video, we're going to talk about portfolio optimization. The problem exists because we want to find the best investment based on our risk preference and investment constraints. The objective here is to solve mean variance portfolio optimization problems, which includes visualizing efficient frontier and finding the weights of optimal portfolio. When we want to analyze anything in finance, we usually begin with the market data. With the data feed toolbox, we can import market data from various data sources such as Bloomberg, Reuters, and Yahoo. After getting the market data, we can move to the next phase called Explore and Discover. In this phase, we will create portfolio, estimate mean, and covariance, set investment constraints, and run portfolio optimization. Now I'm going to switch to MATLAB. This is a 2016A version. The first step here is to import the list of assets that we might find in our retirement portfolio from Microsoft Excel. In the table, there are four columns, ticker, full name of the fund, type, and segment. Let's import the data. MATLAB provides completely interactive tools to make data importing as simple as selecting the data ranges you want. I am going to open the live script first. Since we have already got all tickers, we can easily connect to Yahoo and retrieve the data of each ticker one by one using for loop. Moreover, I also import the last price of five-year treasury yield from Yahoo and convert it into percent per month, which will be used as a risk-free asset later. We can simply convert the price data into return data in just one line of code by using price to return function from Econometrics toolbox. Next is portfolio optimization process. First, we define P as a portfolio with all tickers that we created earlier. Now we can estimate means and covariance of all assets in the portfolio by using just one line of code. I'm going to set a default constraint such that you can't short the asset and you have to invest 100% of your money, nothing more and nothing less. We are using built-in practitioner level functions in financial toolbox such as estimate max sharp ratio and estimate port moments to find the weights of optimal portfolio that maximize sharp ratio together with its risk and return. These built-in functions enable us as financial experts to spend our time working on interesting financial problems instead of reinventing the wheel and writing code. The last section of codes is for visualizing the result. The graph here is the efficient frontier, which is mainly drawn by using plot frontier function. The table here is the weight of optimal portfolio, which was plot as yellow star in the efficient frontier. In summary, I hope you can see how easy it is to perform portfolio optimization in MATLAB together with financial toolbox, data feed toolbox, and econometrics toolbox. There are a lot of things you can do in portfolio optimization with MATLAB, such as implementing many types of constraints or changing types of portfolio optimization. With MATLAB documentation, video, and webinar, you will find it very easy to perform portfolio optimization. We explored portfolio optimization. However, it is possible to do much more with MATLAB, ranging from applications such as time series analysis to risk analysis, and even algorithmic trading. In case you need more information, you can watch more videos on this page, or you can request a trial on MATLAB to start a trial immediately. There are many toolboxes available for you to try out Thank you very much for watching this video presentation.